Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5 and Season 10 of the AR-12 Racing Championship presented by Elgato. For Season 10, we have gone big, really, really big. I am not even joking when I say this. Elgato has dropped some dollar dollar bills on us. There is a five thousand dollar prize pool for the guys in the finale which should be awesome the way this is gonna work is there are seven qualifying races this is number one the winner from each qualifying race will move on to the finale that five thousand dollars will be split up between those eight people so everybody in the final is going home with something so that means the winner of today's race the worst that they will take home is $100. As per always, none of this would be possible without our awesome friends over at Elgato. If you do wanna check out our friends at Elgato, they make some really cool stuff like all of the lights I use, they make the webcam I use, all of the gameplay that you see in every single video, that's using Elgato stuff. So if you've ever wanted to live stream or make videos on YouTube, you gotta go and check them out. There's a link down below. As per always, if you guys want to compete in this series for yourself and have a chance to win that money, you can sign up over on our Discord server. There's also a link for that in the description down below as well. You guys are probably wondering where we're racing today. Well, I went in and I built a custom circuit. It is 10 miles of twists and turns that go all around Mexico, head over to the festival, take a look at the racing line, realize what you can do, and also jump over some obstacles. That's it, that's all I'm gonna show you. As for what we're racing, we're bringing it back. I want you guys to show me what is Forza Horizon 5's best barn find. Go to the festival, build what you think is the fastest barn find, Come back outside, we'll meet outside the main festival, and we'll see what everyone's got. You're probably wondering what class as well. Ha ha ha. I didn't actually decide on a class. I'm gonna let Twitch chat decide what class we race with. I saw fire, one of our AR-12 mods say S1. Eight, two, zero. Okay. These are all of the barn finds in Forza Horizon 5. However, there are some vehicles you're not actually allowed to use. If you go into the AR-12 website, there's actually a list of black listed vehicles that we kind of consider to be OP or way too fast. What car should we build? I'm gonna let you guys choose what we should make. A lot of Twitch chat actually says use the Dodge Viper. I love the Dodge Viper. It's an awesome vehicle. Some people in Twitch chat are also asking me to use the Corvette. The Corvette's definitely old school. Wait, what class is the Dodge Viper bone stock? <gasps> The Dodge Viper's bottom of A class. I think we have to take the Viper. I think we gotta take this. I love the Dodge Vipers. They've actually been one of my favorite vehicles for the past couple of years in Forza games. Oh my god, I could I could diesel swap it. Okay, I don't think we're gonna do that. We can toss a 7 liter V12 engine in. Jeez. That also gives us 800 horsepower. Do we swap the engine? Nathan says he hasn't done it. Okay, I guess we're gonna keep our stock engine in here, okay? We're also gonna keep this thing rear wheel drive just to save even more PI. I think, though, we will get some twin turbos on this thing. We're also gonna want some arrow with this thing because we're driving on a proper race circuit, so rear arrow and front arrow, thank you very much. We're also gonna want some better tires on this thing. Ooh, semi-slick tires already take us up into S1. Twitch chat says take rally tires. I just don't trust the rally tires very much. Like, in terms of the handling, they're a 6.4 and a 6.2. The, the, the sport tires are a 6.3 and a 5.9. So I guess the rally tires are actually the best. I'm gonna trust in the rally tires, okay? And because we're rear wheel drive, I guess we'll make our rear tires a little bit thicker. 355 in the rear, that is huge. I'm not gonna mess around with my track width for right now. We need to save our PI points as much as we can. We will go for some better brakes because our stock brakes are trash on this thing. I just know that somebody in this race is gonna be rocking like 800 horsepower and I just won't be able to keep up on the straights and there are some pretty big ones. With 800 horsepower, I think I've gotta go sport weight reduction. I think I need to balance it out. I need to upgrade my transmission as well, but I guess we'll go for a race clutch. I have no idea what to do. I think we just say we go for the cornering, okay? S1 class, 820 PI exactly. 
We weigh less than 3,000 pounds, which is awesome, but we don't have that much horsepower, which makes me a little bit nervous, but... Ah, we'll see. Um, all right. Clearly, there's something that we don't know. If you've got all of the tryhardy boys in the Dodge Dart, I think there's something we don't know. Wait, the Dodge Darts have 1,300 horsepower? Uh-oh. I did forget to mention the other sponsor of today's video, Dodge. All right, moving on. Let's, let's go and start up this race. Race number one of the AR-12 Racing Championship presented by Elgato. There is your share code and there is your first look at the actual map. Considering everyone said they have 1,300 horsepower, I'm a little bit nervous. I'm starting up all the way at the front. Yes, Nathan and I, the Dodge Vipers, get the streamer luck. P1, P2. Like I said, watch out for the racing line, just the nature of custom-made circuits. They can sometimes be a bit sus. Without further ado, race number one of the AR-12 racing champ. And ship presented by Elgot. So, all right, we're down eight, nine, ten. I'm in eleventh, eleventh place. La I'm in last. I'm in. I'm in last place. Oh yeah, Twitch chat. Let Twitch chat pick the car. They said it would be fun. They said brilliant stuff. Anyways, Yeetler leads them after corner one. Very nicely done. I see everybody hitting those corner cuts. Apex misses the checkpoint. We are no longer last. Yeetler still holding P1. Firefox P2, Milo P3. This is where we got a real people in though. I do not need any breaks. I've got to go. This is where I've got to catch up to all of these dodge darts. This is good. Cut the corners where I can. Like I said, you need to be aware of the checkpoint placement as fast as possible. We're not actually losing them that badly. Milo's moved up to P2 now. Firefox down to P3. Send it into the festival. Come on. Come on. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Get on the brakes early. They're running it a bit deep in the, in the, in the dodge dart. We move up some positions there and pass the Ferrari 250 GTO. I, th I think that was Nathan. Good, good job, Nathan. We've moved up to P8, though. Welcome to the Horizon Festival. Yeetler still has P1. Jeez, Yeetler is so far in front. Look at the mini-map. He's gone. He's actually gone. That is insane. The 250 GTO pushing me for P7. Watch out for the breaking line again. Past the festival. Over the jump. Hold it clean. Hold it clean. Nicely done. We're about 50% of the way through now. There's the Dodge Dart again. Horsepower was the name of the game today. The Dodge Dart battling with the 250 GTO. They have to slow down super, super early. Oh my God. This is like a battle of horsepower versus lightness. Uh-oh. Oh, the Dodge Dart again, again. Horsepower isn't everything, I'm just saying. Hello, Nathan, how are you doing? There goes the Viper. Oh my God, oh my God, late breaking point. Nicely done, Nathan. Nathan up to P8. We're in P10. Oh my God, this is a very good battle for like basically last. No, Vordy must have missed a checkpoint. Went from P2 all the way down to P6. That is very, very unfortunate. Crypto Knight, there is the first rage quit. I want to get this 250 GTO. Yeeler's literally about to DNF the entire grid. This is kind of sad. There we go. Reel him in. Reel him in. Another dodge dart misses the checkpoint. Break hard, 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 hard. Ferrari not breaking hard. There we go. It's actually kind of a good thing we went with these rally tires. We can kind of cut across the grass really nicely and and not lose any grip, which is good. Oh my God, Yeetler though, absolutely flying. Already across the line, Yeetler takes P1, guarantees himself a spot in the finale. 
Yeetler GG out there. That's just rude how badly this guy was. There's some fast people in this lobby. I and then there's Yeetler who's just on another level. It, it's not even like it was close. He had a 10 second gap. And just like that, the Dodge Dart has been blacklisted from future races. Yeetler, absolutely massive props to you. We'll see you in the final. The worst prize that you can get is a hundred bucks now, which is awesome. Like I said, if you wanna sign up for the next race, go join the Discord server. And if you're lucky, you might be selected. And while you're in the description, don't forget to check out Elgato. They make some really, really awesome stuff.